Okay, so today we're doing an electric guitar unboxing. This is the ESP LTD EC-401 Fluence electric guitar black, black satin finish. Uh, it's got a mahogany body, three-piece mahogany neck. It's a uh, 24.75 inch scale. Uh, has a dual action truss rod. The fingerboard is supposedly ebony, but a lot of people are saying it's some sort of uh, ferro wood or something like that. I'm not sure. If you know what type of wood that is, let me know in the comments. Uh, it's a 13.78 inch radius. It's got extra jumbo frets. 24 frets. Uh, nut width is 1.65 inches uh, or 42 millimeters. Um, the cool thing about this guitar is it has the Fishman Fluence Modern Pickup Set uh, with a neck pickup being Al Nico and the bridge pickup being ceramic. Um, both active pickups. Uh, it has a three-way switch um, three knobs, volume, volume, and tone. Grover tuners. A Tone Pros bridge that says it's locking. I'm not quite sure what that means. And it also has a Fluence voicing select by pushing or pulling on one of the knobs. Probably the tone knob. Okay, so... Let's uh, check it out. Box is pretty much blank. Doesn't say anything on it. Uh, again, this is an open box item from Musician's Friend. Um, and I got that just because it was the cheapest one and it uh, I wanted to see the quality of these open box items. Let's see what we got. Got the return receipt. Okay, so it's another box inside here. It's the ESP box. Pretty small box. How it Okay, so you got the big box, and then you got this smaller triangular box. Now since this is open box, you can see where the first tape was, and then there's a new tape across the center. So let's cut that open. One piece. I think there's another piece up there. Not a long piece. There we 
There you go. There's that. Okay, so they're saying do not open with a box cutter. That's fine. Good thing I used scissors. Okay, so we got bubble wrap. Got some desiccant this time. Got some tools over here. Got Allen wrenches, three different sizes big one, small, and a little bit bigger. That's good to have. I can see it already through the through this wrap, wherever this wrapping is. It looks really cool. Okay, there you go. Rubber band around the headstock. Hmm. Okay. Diodario XL. That must mean it's got Diodario strings out of the box. Six hundred points if you register with them. Uh, Grover Tuners, world's finest machine heads. Lifetime guarantee. If they fail for any reason, return them for fast and friendly, no charge, repair, or replacement. That's nice. Okay, this headstock looks pretty clean. So this is pretty cool, um, LTD um, was using a different logo before, um, they had more of like a cursive lettering thing here, and this is their old logo, and this is the first guitar I've seen that they brought back the old logo, so I thought that was pretty cool. Made in Korea, which is okay. Serial number starts with a 19, so I can probably assume it was made in 2019. And this was on open box sale. Inspected in the U.S. Ooh. This looks pretty nice. Strap buttons are good. This is like a neck through or a set neck something. It's all one piece, which is pretty cool. Fishman Fluence pickups. 
they are a little bit angled. Like the neck pickup is really angled to the strings. So, see how that goes. Knobs feel strong. I think you pull on this. Okay, there you go. Got a little tag on there for the to let you know to push and pull on it. The pushing and pulling feels pretty solid. So it definitely looks cool, man. Fretboard does not look like ebony. It is very light colored. Inlays look good though. Fret ends are not sharp. close to being in tune. Output jack looks good. Feels strong. Pretty cool looking actually. Alright, let's check it with the tuner. Okay, it looks like it's tuned to E flat. Half step down already, out of the box. So I'd say you just leave it like that. For now. which feels pretty good. Okay, let's plug it in, make sure everything works on it. Input jack is very solid. This is a screw, screw-on battery compartment. I kind of like the ones with the uh, where you just pop it open. I think those are a little bit more efficient. So I'm just gonna assume there's a good battery in there. Setup seems.
seems pretty good. The action is really... <laughs> is pretty low. Okay, so that is the ESP LTD EC-401 Fluence in black satin, open box, pretty cool. Um, that's it, thanks for watching, have a great day.